This is uncomplicated as possible. So here's a few bits and pieces. It's a nice little piece of brass rod. And um, brass is just the best metal, I believe, for musical instruments. It's just got that nice um, ring to it, nice tone, much nicer than steel. And a uh, bit of elastic cord, a bit of stretchy stretchy. That's the basic two elements. I'm just going to make a sort of a sort of a, some kind of situation like that. And it pulls down onto the fretboard with the elastic. Okay, so capo pushes pushes down on the strings like that, um, but the fretboard here has a a nice little curve, a nice radius in it. So I have to put a curve into the uh, capo. And then um, figure out a way of fastening it like that. Voila. It's just about right like that, but yeah, just a wee curve. So that'll be fairly straightforward, just have to set it up so these things don't fall off. A little bit of a hook or a, an indent in the, each end, and that'll do the job quite nicely, I think. All right. Okay, so my first thing is to, uh, I think I'll get the, put a little, little curve into the rod, just a slight one. Slight like bend. So about leave that much straight. And the old voice. Just, just do this. Do the same from the other side, I think. See how that works. Okay, get that from the other side. Let's 
see the sort of curve. It should it looks pretty good actually. Anything I might have gone a bit far. I'll just test it on the guitar. Okay, so let's have a look. That's good. Okay, it's showing promise. I might have put yeah, a little bit too much curve on it, I think. Yeah, that buzzing, it's not getting pushed. Yeah. No, I don't know. Yeah, okay. See that there, and then I might straighten that one out a bit. That's looking nice. Yeah, it might have gone a bit too far. I'll just straighten it out a fraction. Okay, I think that'll be good. Notches in there that's going to give the elastic something to grab into. Cool. And clever with this other end. Just have to figure out exactly what that's going to be.
dear. <laughs> that wasn't cool. What happened? See that? That's the end of the drill sticking out. Couldn't see that side. Couldn't see what was going on. That's the end of that drill. <laughs> Your idea. stainless steel wire and you're going to bend that in half Okay, any idea? Oh, let's take it down to about there. Pshon! Yeah, mini bolt cutters. Perfect for this stuff. It's so hard to cut with just normal side cutters. Get in there. Let me just take a scratch more off because it might be about right actually. Is that cord? This is going to keep the cord in place, so that actually might be about the right length. Oh, yeah, you can take, a, take a bit more off. Left hand thread that way. Okay. Now you looking stuff. Don't need much. Look at that. It's a bit messy at the moment, but we'll clean it up a bit. Let's 
this is pretty rough. I don't know if we had a hundred. Oh yeah, it's in four hundred. I know how riveting it is watching sanding and all that. Here it is. Beautiful thing that it is. So, let's see if I go through there. Just. Maybe not. Come on, come on. Good. Ugh. Ugh. Mm, I thought I'd made it bigger than that. Bit of uh, encouragement. And you go. There we go. Yes. Okay. Awesome. Das. So we not. Just one little extra piece of perfection for this project is this. Ow! Ow! <laughs> no blood. Um, bit of plastic tubey stuff. It's a bit wrong, so it can get in the way of the rubbery. Let me just see how we go. Okay, so that just gives it a bit more give, a bit, more, a bit of padding there. Oh, I hooked that over. Look at that, one capo. Let's tie up these ends here. Make sure that knot is real tight. Push your nose down. I don't 
just getting a bit of a melt. Oh, wait. Just a little whoop. Yeah, that much neater. Okay. How many times can you say okay in one video? Answer a lot. Look at that. I'm loving it. So now you want to put it on the first fret, which is actually where I do want to put it. It's alive! Alrighty. Okay. So that's what we've ended up with. I'm really pleased with that. Cool. And uh I Do a better job not losing this one. Love it. Love it. Always feels good when uh, a project goes smoothly. And also if you make something musical, that's always, always a bonus. Thanks for watching that guys, I hope you got something out of it, um, I know I did, it's always a bit of fun, uh, I love making whatever crazy stuff that comes out of my head, um, 
please feel free to add me to your subscription list and uh, we'll catch you next time.